Yeah, I'm getting that. We're, we're down a bit of nitpicking now. Okay. And we want to get this to come across a bit more here. All right. We're basically getting there. We're getting close. We'll back over here again. We'll get this front now. Because I can see that's concerning you. Okay, so what you're doing now is to get that front corner to down, down to drop it. Okay. So we're going to stretch that outer edge. And you're applying more pressure to the yeah. outer edge? Yeah. And a little more on the outside edge. I'm going to run that out now to the edge. Mm -hmm. Put more wheeling right on that edge, right where you want it. Look. Far off of there now. It shouldn't be far off of there now. Let's have a look. Right on our original form. Not far off of that one. Wow. Now, wow. Okay. Good there God. You go. Well, you've got to finish off now. Yeah. You've got, the, you've got the gist of it now. Yeah. Though, you? Yeah. Well, yeah. We'll see when you yeah. do your side. Well, this is what I came here for, Jeff. Just to uh, see this being done. That's it. There you go. We're down on it now. Let's see. We're right on it there now. Disregard this because this panel's right. not even. Right. Put your hand on that bill. Yeah. You can't work to that. It's shit. Yeah, right. <laughs> I, I, I can feel it. Yeah, yeah. If you used to wheel to that, the panel would be like this. So yeah. Okay. I'm going to do the best I can with the right. we've got. Okay. I'm going to drop that back edge in, and we're down now to smoothing that off. And we'll be chasing this front edge in then on the former. Mm -hmm. I'm going to drop that down. It's a bit tight there, but again, that's because the former's kicking up. Okay. But we'll go back to the wheel. And then we'll put that back in and come up the tag. Take the pressure off. We don't want a lot of return in the back here. And you're doing this now to drop that back edge? Yeah. Okay. A fairly light pressure. Light pressure now. We don't want a lot of return on this. And back. you're going all the way out to the edge though. Right out to the edge. Okay. Right edge. Now I'm going to go right through just to smooth it out. Carefully now. It'll probably take a bit of the shape out now. That's all right, we can come back again. And you're doing this now to blend? Yeah, we're blending all that edge in nice and neat. Okay. How nice is that? If your finger's probably straightened up a little bit now, but that's okay. You're gonna go back to cross wheeling it again. <clears throat> no, that's all right, it's okay, it's not too bad. Nice fit. I'll drop that back edge on there. Well, that one's chopping off now. Uh, the center line. Chopping up center line there. I can probably take a bit of that off, I think. That's, that's the center of the turn there. Come up to there, I think. Up to there, it's nothing. Because if you try and Get that to go over, you're going to be down this side, and we don't want to be down that side. Again, it's an angle. Hold that. We'll leave the front as it is, I think we're okay with that. All right. Drop that one off when we're going to the sharp wheel there. Tip that corner over. Right,
power events, very far. You just want to drop this over here now, just tighten that up so it drops on. Okay. And you're going to do that through cross wheeling? No, we're going to go straight through there with a high crown wheel. Okay. Purpose of the cross wheeling is to do what? Purpose of the cross wheeling is to smooth it all out and give you a nice even radius going this way. Going full length, traverse in front to back with a reasonably high crank. Hold on, uh, it stuck. W would you start that again? Yeah, purpose of cross wheeling is to put the shape in across the top of the panel this way. When you traverse forwards and backwards with a higher crown wheel, you, you're putting the, putting the shape in across this way. Mm -hmm. When you go this way, you're putting the shape in this way when you cross wheel. When you cross wheel, yeah. you're getting, got it. You're getting in that way, because it's forming over the, the high crown of the wheel, yeah, mm -hmm. going this way. So it will form this way. When you traverse with a high crown wheel going for, forwards and backwards, it's going to go that way, yeah? Got it. Making sense? Got it. Yeah. 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 So just bear that one in mind. And as you can see now, the panel is beginning to take on quite a nice form now. You see that? Mm -hmm. You know, with all the wheeling that we've done there, Bill, we haven't destroyed the panel because you're not wheeling with loads of pressure. Mm -hmm. You see that, James? It's all, it's all 99% there. Mm -hmm. Keeping control of that all the time. Although it looks as I'm just raking it through, I'm not, I'm doing it should we use the word scientifically? <laughs> <laughs> Methodically. Methodically, that's the one. Not like scientifically itself. I've only just learned that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All I'm doing now is I'm going to tip that back over. You could do this by hand, really. You could just bend that by hand, but because it's only 1.2 alley, you'll end up putting creases where you don't want it. So we'll just lightly wheel that. And always with a high crown wheel, they require a different type of treatment. But which I mean, treat it with respect. Don't use any pressure. Use it as an anvil just to pull your panel over. See how that came over, look? You see how that came over, Bill? Yeah. yeah. Now if you put pressure on that, you'd have striped it up and mm -hmm. made a mess. Mm -hmm. You know, we, anybody can make a mess. Mm -hmm. James is good at that. <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> Right, well, that would be the one thing I'd be better than James at. Yeah, right, well, you won't be. <laughs> See that? You know, we pulled that over. Yeah. Light pressure. Right, back on your form. Just check where we're going. And we're down to getting on now to finish it. Look at that. That doesn't fit. I'll be a. Well, what can you say about that? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Now we'll finish the panel now. Now we want light pressure. We're going to try this out right, go right the way into the return now. So smooth it all out. <coughs> See that? We've got a different shape going on there. Mm -hmm. okay. You can do that now, Bill, can't you? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, of course <laughs> you can. See how this, this area here is, is expanded more than it is in there? Stretch this area more, and then work your metal out to the edge, lighten up with your pressure, wheel it where you want the shape. The more stretch here, stretch it there. Not here, there. Be precise. That's a big rollick in every machine, but it's a precision tool. And in the hands of a craftsman, you can do it. In the hands of an idiot, you're going to be wasting your time, aren't it? Mm -hmm. Okay? Back over here then. 
only want light pressure now. We're going to finish up. We're back to pattern number one.